This next story may be bad news for business owners. Indiana owes billions of dollars to the federal government, and Indiana businesses will pay that bill. News 10's Louisa Muller joins us live in the studio to explain. Louisa? Mark Patrice, next year businesses will have to pay more money to the state. It comes up to roughly $21 per employee. That's because Indiana borrowed nearly $2 billion from the federal government to pay for unemployment benefits. So how did it all get that bad? Businesses pay taxes into a state fund that pays for unemployment. But in 2008, that fund went broke because so many people were collecting benefits. To continue offering unemployment, Indiana borrowed money from the federal government. Now they owe the federal government that borrowed money plus interest. And the state has decided it's time to pay it back. The federal government gives you an unlimited credit line, but eventually needs you to pay it back. And if you don't pay it back in a reasonable amount of time, pay it back with interest. And that's what's going on here. Businesses will have to start paying that extra money on January 1st and continue paying it through 2011. Back to you. Thanks, Louisa. The first payment of about $60 million will be due to the federal government by the end of September 2011. Now